All right, this is very exciting. It's very exciting for many reasons, but as we work to revitalize Broadway, as we work to uh, preserve Broadway and all its history, initially when we started our Bringing Back Broadway initiative, we were focusing on the 20s and 30s with all the neon lights, the Hollywood type atmosphere. Uh, but now we realized that we've got to look back at Broadway and preserve all the eras that existed here. And one of the most important eras for Broadway was in the 1970s and 80s when you had a majority of people walking these streets who were Latino immigrants. And uh, now, I mean, they're still here. We, we still uh, walk these streets and shop. But in the 70s and 80s, I mean, this is where a majority of Latino immigrants from the surrounding area would come to uh, shop, to be entertained at the theaters. For example, the Million Dollar Theaters, where many of the Mexican artists would come from Mexico and perform. Uh, and this mural was put up at that time. The building owner said, hey, I want a Latino, I recognize Latino to be put up on the wall uh, because if you look down on the streets, those are the people who are here. And so uh, the artist thought of Anthony Quinn and um, now that this has been up there uh, and as downtown is changing, as we're looking to preserve its history, um, we thought it was very important to preserve this bureau for what it represents. It represents the era of the 70s and 80s on Broadway and a Mexican immigrant achieving his American dream. And it also represents all that Anthony Quinn achieved in his lifetime. So I'm very excited to do this because uh, after all, it's not only that preservation of Broadway and Anthony Quinn's life, but it's about restoring more murals in the city of LA.